Pumpkin. Pumpkin. Hey, it's Mandy, and this is my first diary kind of video, and I would love to share some things with you. The reason why is because I want to take you on this little adventure where I am planning. Yeah, these last two years, like I've been on my world trip in 2019. I've been back now for two years. First year was amazing um, besides COVID and of course all the measurements. I did make the most of it. I still had that like free spirit inside of me. So I was exploring Holland. I went on a lot of hikes. I enjoyed uh, spending time with friends, family and I yeah, I decided that I wanted to stay in that same flow. I've learned so much on my trip that I wanted to to use that knowledge and yeah, add it in my daily routines like I the, the values, the things I valued so much in my traveling. And yeah, I, I did pretty well the first year. I found a job, I had a rhythm, I chose not to work full-time anymore, I chose to do it part-time. So that left me with a lot of free time to explore, which I was doing in the year before as well. So it felt like I was still sort of traveling, but then in my own country. I planned this like a camping trip by myself, just me, my car, my bike and my tent. And three weeks long I was just camping alone and yeah. I was just so thankful for feeling such, yeah, feeling so free and careless, I would say. Then I met uh, Viri in December 2020. Yeah, we did many, many amazing things together. Like we made Thai packages, like food uh, packages together. Uh, we did a lot of nice trips. We made videos. I helped him, he helped me. Eddie uh, already had contact with Roberta uh, because he was there a couple of years ago. But he told me that they always had this plan to yeah, organize a trip together. And because I worked at a travel agency for eight years, um, I was quite interested in that in that plan. Um, she messaged us with very good news. So she needs some help to promote her San Sicily project. It's a really great project because it's about self-care, yoga, being surrounded by nature, peacefulness, uh, good food, always uh, important. She, she messaged us she needed some help and she will give us freedom to organize our own trips like excursions, cooking workshops we thought. I love hiking so I would love to take people on a hike for a picnic. So many ideas. So I think in like now we're going to have a phone call with her. So I will let you know how that went. It's super exciting and I can't believe that we're maybe going to do this. Sometimes it's good to open new doors and like stay curious and learn new things that's yeah something i i learned from traveling and which i can probably experience again in 2022 so amazing <laughs> 